Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Microbiology Easy Notes. If you like this channel, please like, subscribe, comment and share. Today we are going to know what are the tools and equipment used in microbiology lab. So let's get started. First is Petri dish. It is made up of glass or disposable plastic. It is used for culturing microbial cells. Next is Tongs. Tongs is made up of heat resistant material. It is used to pick up hot and evaporating materials and items. Next is Conical Flask. Conical flask is used for holding and measuring liquid material. It is also used for the preparation of microbial cultures. Next is Beaker. Beaker is made up of heat and acid resistant glass. Is it used for li holding liquid and it is perfect for heating a liquid by being placed on the top of trap pot over a Bunsen burner. Next is funnel. It is a tube or a pipe that wide at the top and narrow at the bottom. It is used for guiding liquid or powder into small opening. Microbiology layer funnel is made up of glass or plastic. Next is glass spreader. Glass spreader is a hand tool used to spread microbe cells on culture plate. It is made up of glass, plastic or metal and come in various shapes. Next is inoculation loop. It is also called inoculation wand, micro streaker or smear loop. There is a loop at the end which is made up of twisted metal like platinum, tungsten or nichrome. Inoculation loop is used for pickup and transfer a small sample from a culture of microorganisms like for streaking on culture plate. Next is glass slide. Glass slide is a thin flat piece of glass typically 75 mm by 26 mm and about 1 mm thick. It is used to hold objects for examination under microscope. Next is measuring cylinder. It is a glass piece of laboratory equipment used to measure the volume of liquid. There are marked lines on the cylinder represents the amount of liquid that has been measured. Next is forceps. It is used for gripping and manipulating small or delicate objects. It is made up of stainless steel, disposable plastic or reusable plastics. Next is weighing machine. It is used to measure weight or mass of an object or material. Next, pipette. It is an essential laboratory tool used to dispense measured volume of liquid. There are many types of pipettes used in laboratories. Graduated pipette, single channel pipette, multi channel pipette, and repeat dispensing pipette. Next is hot air oven. Hot air oven is an electrical device which is used to heat sterilize different objects. Next is autoclave. Autoclave is used to sterilize laboratory equipment, instruments, clothing, and other materials. There are so many types of autoclave available in the market which are varying in size, shape and functionality. In autoclave, liquid and solids, both types of materials can be sterilized. Next is hot plate. Hot plate is a device which has electric heating elements or a gas burner. It is used to heat the samples and to perform chemical reactions. Next is colony counter. It is used to estimate the liquid culture's density of microorganisms by individual colonies on an agar plate, slide or petri dish. Next is incubator. Incubator is an insulated and heated box which is used to grow and maintain microbiological or cell culture. Incubator maintains optimal temperature, humidity and gaseous content of the atmosphere inside. Next is Laminar Flow Cabinet. Laminar Flow Cabinet is an enclosed bench which is designed to prevent airborne contamination while handling sensitive materials. This device provides zone of particle free air which is important in microbiology lab. Next is Spatula. Spatula is made up of metal like stainless steel or nickel. 
it is used to take out material and shaking and mixing of different compounds next is test tube it is a cylindrical tube of a clear glass it is open at one end and rounded at other test tube is used for qualitative experiments and assays next is bunsen burner it is used to heat samples with high or low heat for sterilization and for other purposes it minimizes the possibility of microorganisms falling into bench and open space now microscope microscope provide magnified image of an object and cells which makes them easier to study types of microscopes used in microbiology lab are compound microscope fluorescent microscope electron microscope and x-ray microscope next is disinfectant spray it is very important disinfectant is a chemical which is used to remove microorganisms which can cause cross contamination or responsible for health hazards there are many types of disinfectants with varied efficiency now lab coat it is a piece of personal clothing which provides protection to skin from incidental contact and splashes lab coat is essential when working with hazardous materials biological agents and chemicals